Hi. It's been a while. It's the last day of the semester, and I'm on my way to Rapson right now because we have our final studio presentations tonight. So over the semester, we've been working on these lamps, and we finally have all our prototypes and posters made, so that's what I'm going to show you guys tonight. Okay, so for the Secret Santa that you just saw, I got some furry red slippers. They kind of remind me of Elmo. Some socks and some jewelry from the loop. This really pretty pair of earrings. And, and this pre-layered necklace that I think is pretty. I like to get tangled a lot, but I think it's really pretty. I don't think I've mentioned this yet, but over winter break this year, I'm going to Hong Kong for a two-week study abroad session. It's called Product Design Hong Kong, and we're going to be learning about toy manufacturing. So I want to vlog like every single day, kind of like I did in Puerto Rico, and have like a series up, like a playlist up on my channel. So I'm trying to catch up on all my footage from summer up until now. So wish me luck. On another note, Peter and I are going to Holodazzle tonight. So Holodazzle is like a Minneapolis tradition. It's like to celebrate the holidays, hence Holodazzle. And it's like a yearly thing and it's in Warren Park and it's actually like 40 degrees out and it's like supposed to be like 35 when we go so I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, we're at Holodazzle. You wanna go that way by the boot tree? And Holodazzle, that's what it's called. And I'm excited for the food. That's what we came here for, <laughs> the food. It's biking kind of slow, so it's not, it's not going very fast. Hello, I've been in Rapson Hall for how long? Is it? I've been here for about six hours now. I decided to stay at school for a couple more days so I could get some work done on my portfolio so I can start applying for internships and it's turning out to be very difficult. They never really gave us a lot of advice on how to put together our portfolios and I know it's a very like personal thing and everyone's portfolio is different but it still would have been nice to get a couple tips and tricks on like layout especially for our 
PDF portfolios, but yeah, that's what I've been doing. I just have to add one more project and do some touch-ups on some of my other things, but yeah, I guess your portfolio is always a work in progress, so I shouldn't feel too bad, but it's a lot. So my Prima Beats were my first project of the semester for my sketching project, and then we moved on to my shoe project, so I decided to do like a luxury wedge, and this is my final one. This was a designer's choice project, so I decided to do a sled for Radio Flyer, because I'm applying for an internship there, though it's really competitive, I don't know if I'll get it, but I thought this might be something cool to put in my portfolio that might make me stand out. So I have my semester projects in a different folder, or a different document. Um, this one actually wasn't a semester, but it was, it felt like it. That was our challenge project from last year. I'm not fi quite finished with this page yet. And then um, this was my freshman semester, my fall freshman semester um, project. And I just have the, the research that I did and the, the CAD model and key shot rendering here. Hello. Tomorrow I'm going home for break, and Peter's going home on Thursday. So we're exchanging Christmas presents right now, and he wrote me a Christmas code. I don't think I mentioned this, but Peter asked me out writing a code. It's right up there. I don't know, I guess this is supposed to be cute or something. I wrote her a code for Christmas, because I knew that I was really going to miss her. Because we're gone for eight whole days. Yeah, and then I'm going to Hong Kong for two weeks, a week after he gets back. So here's her reaction. Uh, <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> Are those presents? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> oh, you even have two different types of snowflakes. I do, they're unique. No two snowflakes are the same. <laughs> You're right. And the snowball. Thank you. You're welcome. Merry Christmas. Ready? I have her four presents. Didn't wrap a single one. That's fine. Given one was a computer program. Yeah, that's a little hard to wrap. But here's the present that... I got a month ago. Started dating a month ago. So she didn't know me too well. I would have been, I'm bad at coding. <laughs> and I really liked her. That's all she really knew about me. Yeah. Wow. It's so heavy. Yo, you didn't. <laughs> no way. Did you get this before we went? No. I got it, like, the day after we went to see, like... You didn't. That's why you told me not to get it. I'm yeah. going <laughs> back the next time. I was like, what are you talking about? Bath and Body Works, we need a gift card. It was like... <sighs> no. You're so sweet. Just a backstory. We went to Mall of America, and we went into Bath and Body Works. And um, I like saw this cologne that I really liked. And uh, I was like, oh no, like I don't really want it. And Nicole was like, oh no, you should get it. No thanks. And she went back the next day and got it for me. <laughs> How sweet is that? Oh my god. Okay, wait. So our one of our like first dates was to go to Sea Life because he had never been and he was he was adorable. He was acting like a little boy the whole time. But um Sharks are scary. We went to Bath and Body Works and he was like, yeah, like I love this cologne. And then I was like, you should get it. He was like, no, and then he didn't. And he was like, why didn't I get that cologne? And I was like, because you're dumb. So I went, I like went back with my friend, like coincidentally, um, we went to the mall and I just decided to pick it up because I figured we'd be together for, for longer than a month. So um, I picked it up. And then a couple weeks ago, we went back to the mall just like, to walk around and stuff and he was like wait i need to stop at bath and body works to get that cologne that i wanted the first time and i was like no you don't <laughs> no <laughs> you don't need that cologne 
And he was like, no, like I'm almost out of cologne. Like I need to smell good. Like I want to get this cologne. And I was like, no, you don't. <laughs> Wait until I get a coupon. I was like, yeah, like I'm going home this weekend. Like we always have a ton of coupons. No one ever gets anything at Body Bath and Body Works without coupons. Like, just wait until I go get coupons and then you can buy it. And then I actually never got coupons and we never went back, so it worked. And now I can smell good. <laughs> now you can smell like teak wood. Like teak wood. There we go. <laughs> Do you like it? I, I mean, I like the box. I liked how it smelled in the store. So I hope so. What is that? I like the box. I do. Look how nice it is. It's gray with nice silverish gold accents. He likes the box. I do. So romantic. So romantic. <laughs> I'm home and my room is a mess. I have my fur babies chilling on the bed. She's looking at a squirrel and she's vibrating. <laughs> Mom brought home the goods from school. So I'm trying to do some sketching right now. And it's a bit difficult with this one on my lap. Would not recommend. It's the day after Christmas and now it decides to snow. My dad just dropped off this package. Um, I had ordered an adapter for Hong Kong and it just got here. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be, but let's see. Okay, this is what it looks like. And the things come out here. Oh, there's a retractor button. So hopefully it works, because I don't have time to buy another one. I had ordered this bag to take with me to Hong Kong, so I can just carry this up with me for like day trips and stuff. And I'm pretty happy with it. It feels like pretty good quality, and yeah. So this is what the inside looks like. It has a little pocket here, and a zip one here and some side ones, and this front one. We're actually getting quite a bit. Good morning! So, it's New Year's Eve today, and like every year, um, for the past few years anyways, I'm going to be with Katie and her family um, at Feed My Starving Children as a good way to like give back um, and wrap up slash start the new year. And Peter's gonna be tagging along this year. So it'll be his first time doing Feed My Starving Children. And he's really excited, but he doesn't really know what to expect. So yeah, I think it'll be a fun day today. Daddy, how do you? Are you excited? I'm so excited. Everybody. Hey, Katie. Take a seat. How many boxes did we get? We got 26 boxes. I finally started packing for Hong Kong, and it still hasn't hit me that I'm leaving in like three days, but I'm sure that'll come soon. So I picked up this super cute neck pillow for the flight to Hong Kong, but when I was taking the tag off, it got a hole in it. So I'm gonna try to fix that and with this. Wish me luck. I'm gonna miss you guys. She doesn't even care. Oh. Yeah.